Hello everybody, welcome to Comics and More. Today, we are going to install Unit Boot In from our default Ubuntu repositories. And I will show you how here at Comics and More. So that you will not miss the latest from Comics and More, hit that subscribe button and that notification bell to get the latest from this channel. To start off, we are going to open our terminal here and then we are going to update the packages first. So we are going to type sudo apt install sorry sudo app update and then we're going to type our password okay so it's now at 690% so it's done all packages are up to date so now the next line of code we are going to encode is sudo apt install u net boot in okay, unit boot in is the classic installer when we use it has been around for quite some time already and we are going to install it in our ubuntu system here so after we type this one we're going to hit enter this time we don't need to write again the password and then we'll type yes or y and then hit enter again now ubuntu will be downloading the needed packages for unit booting to be installed A unit button has been a while has been around for a while okay, it has been tested and proven to install ISOs to FAT32 USB flash drives okay so I've been using unit button for a very long time already okay even before Windows 10 was um, was present okay I'm sorry about that so now we're done installing so we will minimize this first and then we're going to type here unit boot in then it's going to ask our password so let's type our password and hit enter Okay, so here is the default unit button GUI window. So, if you want to download the distribution, you can select it here. Let's try to see what are the um, distros you can download. Okay, so let's try Ubuntu. Okay, so the latest it has here is the 14.04 okay so that's the latest again I said Ubuntu oh, no, I'm sorry unit button has been um, present for a while already let's try to look at Zubuntu okay so Zubuntu is still in 14.04 now I haven't downloaded any ISOs yet so you, I can show you how unit button works but you can type here floppy disk or ISO you can still use unit button to install other older versions of Linux distros so I guess that sums up our video for today. 
If you like this video, give us a thumbs up. If you have questions or clarifications, please leave them in the comments down below. And please do not forget to subscribe to our channel, Comics and More. Thank you for watching!